Yeah, no, I don't believe D'Angelo would ever try to yeah, be inactive. I think she always wants to be in motion. She loves fighting. Is American <laughs> Contagious. I was watching the Calligraphy Stampede radio last night, tonight. It was nine ball. I'm worried I might have caught American Isis. Anitis? American Anitis? You might have, dude. This fight very well could be one and one up for grabs here. Round number three. Davis. Ooh, she's got a clock. Hold. Sunni or Sunny or whatever. Suna. She is doing a really good job. She's hitting the girl on the feet. She's pressing the girl. I feel like there's going to be a knockout. I mean, these girls are stepping in and tagging each other. I'm lost, so you're Luna and she's Suna, and I want Tuna. You need to start rapping. She be Luna, I be Suna. Well, no, that would be. She be Suna, I be Luna. We eat Tuna. <laughs> That girl looks beat up. The girl Suna is beaten up. She looks pretty beat. She's getting beat up. Ooh, she just caught another. That Suna's killing her. Boom. I love how she hits her, lands a shot, and goes for that takedown. Always making her think about that takedown. I think that's why she's doing so well on the feet. She's making that other girl think, think about the takedown. Get Luna some tuna. <laughs> I do have, if you go to uh, SoundCloud and look up Luna Wolf Mex, that's the same name as my YouTube. I do have, I've rhymed before on some beats that I made. Oh, Suna is tearing that girl up, dude. She is tearing her up. I have to go on a beer run here in a minute. I'm going to have to pick those. I like how I'm being like, like a boss. I'm going to have to go pick those up later. <laughs> Ooh. We got two minutes. Ten seconds in round three. Oh, Suna is killing this girl. The only thing that's going to win the other girl the fight is if she could knock out or submit Suna. Oh, my dear Lord, you have a mixtape. I don't want to set my phone on fire. It's all right, man. I'm not, like, full of myself. I get embarrassed when I play, like, my raps for other people, you know. But it's all right. If you go to SoundCloud, Luna Wolf from XS, um, I've been doing podcasts lately. I want to do more podcasts. But if you kind of go back, there, I have beats that don't have any uh, lyrics to them. And they're actually pretty decent beats, if I say so myself. What strength is that beer? It's a, a 4.6. 4.6 alcohol. Cahaba is a brewing company that's like right down the street. Ooh, that Suna girl is tearing her up. But yeah, Cahaba Blonde is the name of the beer. If you could order it, dude, I'm telling you, it is a very good beer. It's like a, a light lager or whatever. Really good beer. Got good taste. Gunner is going to dominate his opponent tomorrow. Oh, uh, Sigour. I hope I'm saying that right. I'm going to be streaming that tomorrow too. Sunday. I will be streaming that tomorrow. The uh, the UFC Fight Night or whatever. Ooh, good takedown. Suna. It's over. Suna's got this. Do you use FL Studio for beats? No, actually. Uh, God, I can't remember what it's called. You have to get back with me on that, DJ, because it's on my phone. I can't remember the name of it. I use the uh, the phone for my beats, and then I use another uh, app, which I don't have it anymore on my computer. I use it for uh, I use it for audio. Now that I have a mic again, because my other mic broke, it's somewhere around here. Now that I have a mic again, uh, I'm gonna start doing more rapping. I love saying that. I will start doing more rapping. That's it. Here we go to decision. The hug. They hugging each other. That's Suna, girl. 
whooped her. Is one of the best division in women's mixed martial arts. A lot of fighters from 150 pounds have moved on. Stella is, oh, yeah, Stella Artois. Is going to continue with Stella's my beer choice. Smells of May, 5% volume. Has the nickname in the UK of the white beater. Why does it have that nickname? That's a terrible nickname. <laughs> Yeah, I, I love Stella though. I'm, I'm a big fan of Stella. It's so here. It's so expensive though. It really is, you know. I, I, even though I say that the we have a lot of craft breweries in uh, Birmingham, a lot of craft breweries. Those beers are so expensive. They're good though. This ain't real Dragon Ball Z. This ain't real. Dragon Ball Z is the real. Dude, I love Dragon Ball Z. They got a good, uh, they got a good shirt that I want to buy. It's got, uh, Gohan's the oldest, right? Isn't he the dad? Is it Gohan or Goku? I can't remember which one's the dad. They got the dad. He's sitting on a cloud, kind of, like, slumped over. I want that shirt so bad. I love Dragon Ball Z. I grew up on Dragon Ball Z. Can't pronounce my name right, then try to pronounce. All right, I'm going to try it. Yeah, I'm gonna try and pronounce it like with, with like I'm a, I'm world traveled. Yaf Ayala Jaco. That was it. No, but here we go. Decision. It went to a decision. Here we go. I think my girl Suna has got this. Here's Joe Martinez. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards. Henry Gary has it 30 to 26. Brett Miller and Ross Swanberg both have it 30 to 27. All for your winner by unanimous decision. She is still undefeated. Yup. Yup. Suna and Luna. Suna and Luna. Suna Davis starter. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry, guys. Awesome.